Hello and good morning. Welcome to Affiliate Marketing Dude. I am Marcus, your host as usual. Today what we're going to do is we are going to talk about instant profit strategies. How can you make instant money? Now, this is a very important topic, especially in times like this where people are struggling to make ends meet, struggling to build their businesses, and they kind of see things falling off the cliff in terms of sales and revenue. So today we're going to talk to you about some strategies that you can use in your business or your affiliate marketing, or if you're just starting out, to start to get instant profit. So, very important. We're going to go through two different things because there's two things you need to realize when it comes to instant profit. Number one is you need to have an instant traffic source, right? In order to get instant profits, you need to get instant traffic. So we're going to go through some instant traffic sources you can use. And then secondly, the second thing you need to be able to make instant profit is a good converting offer all right now this offer can be an affiliate offer there's several affiliate offers that pay you directly instantly or it could be a service which you could get paid directly via paypal stripe or whatever payment processor you're using now these are very important because in times like this we need to be on the offensive and we need to go out and get our customers we need to actively do what we need to do to get them so it's very important if you can hear me okay give us a thumbs up give us a note in the box let me know that our sound quality is good I know we have someone out there chopping down half of a forest or something I don't know what they're doing but we're gonna talk about these cool things and we're gonna talk about how to make this work so first thing you need is instant traffic sources now I want you to realize that right now while you're watching this there are people online looking for you there's people looking for your products, your services, the solutions you have to offer, they're out there right now. They might be on YouTube, they might be on Facebook, they might be on search engines, they might be on Pinterest, they might be on Instagram, and they might be on Twitter. Your customers are out there somewhere right now. And what does it take to get a sale? It takes a customer. It takes someone to come in to be interested in what you have to offer and you need to close the deal. So very important, right now we know that there are people out there. So the question is, is how do we get in front of them? So we want to talk to you about some cool things that you can do to start getting instant traffic, okay? So I think we can fit them on here. You know what? Let's go to a new page. We'll put this one down here for later. All right, so we're going to go into our first bit, which is instant traffic sources now this is a live training so if you have a business that you want to do this for type it in the box and i'll go ahead and give you guys some tips for your specific business and then at the end i'll show you how you can learn even more from me right so instant traffic sources that we want to look at are very important one of the instant traffic sources you can use is facebook groups now, a lot of people use this the wrong way and, and they're out there and they're just spamming their message. That's not what we want to do. Spam, it works, obviously, otherwise people wouldn't do it, but it's very short-lived. It's something that can get your account shut down. It's something we don't want to practice it with. What we want to do is we want to go into Facebook groups or create our own Facebook group around a topic. So let's say that you are good at building funnels or you're good at WordPress or something like that. You would go into a Facebook group about WordPress, maybe funnels, maybe Infusionsoft, maybe ClickFunnels, whatever it is that you are good at. And if you're not good at something, you might want to learn it. That's going to help you, right? You can't really just sit back for a month and expect money to roll in. Although this month, you know, some people are getting free checks from the government, but they're not exactly free, right? So we got to look at that. We can go into Facebook groups and we could say, hey, let's go out there and let's find people that are interested or would be interested in what I have to offer. If I'm a WordPress guy, maybe I go in the WordPress group and I start to talk about WordPress tips and I start to listen because in these groups, lots of these groups have 100,000 or more members and you can go in there and someone might have a question about how do I put an opt-in page on my WordPress or how do I do this in Infusionsoft? Or how do I do this with this product or service? And we look at that and people will have questions. A lot of people, maybe there's a group about how to get checks from the government or something, right? We saw years ago, and even now he's ramping up, Matthew Lesko has all kinds of courses and products about that, built a multi-million dollar business around helping people get checks from the government. So you could go out there and you could talk to people in these groups, and these people are there right now. 
And the goal is always to provide value. Now, what does that mean? What does it mean to provide value? If you're in a group of people that are interested in WordPress, what does that mean? Well, that means understanding what the market is into and putting something in front of them that's going to resonate with them. Maybe there's a lot of WordPress people and you know that they struggle with a certain theme or a certain plugin or a certain way to make money or whatever it is. And you could you could go out there and you can come out with a free guide or, or a tip sheet or maybe a video. And you could put that in the group and say, hey guys, I noticed a lot of people were asking questions about this, so I made a little video to help you out. You make that video to help you help them out or that download or whatever it is, and you build that and you post it in the group and people are gonna look at it. Now the goal of posting this is to get people to say, wow, thank you for helping me out. This is something we talked about in last week's training about influence and sales, which is the reciprocity. Reciprocity. Reciprocity means that you give something and they feel obligated to join whatever you have because they're like, hey, I like that, that helped me out. Maybe the thing he's charging for is better. Maybe it's gonna help me, right? And if you do this enough and you get in front of enough people, people are gonna watch your videos, they're gonna look at your content, they're gonna start to understand what's going on and they're gonna be like, wow, you know, that Marcus guy really helps me out. And you guys can see how this works here on this YouTube channel. I make videos for people about how to make money on the internet and how to build their businesses. And people watch the videos, they come to me all the time and they say, Marcus, I've been binge watching your content lately. I'm gonna order something, what do you have? And people are feeling obligated like, wow, you know, I want more. And people will always want more, even if you pretty much give them everything because they want more. Very important, right? Someone says they do handmade crafts, that's excellent. Think about that in a time like now where people are staying home. You can make little videos, you can make little guides on crafts to make with your kids, things to do. Hey, tired of watching TV? Maybe you could knit a scarf or something. I don't know, do you knit scarves? Something like that, right? And you could go out there and you can compile this. Years ago, there was a guy, uh, he goes by the pen name David D'Angelo, I believe, what was his name? Evan, Evan Pagan. And this guy came out with a, a course on how to date people, how to date women, I think it was. And he came out with this course, and what he did is he broke his course up into 52 emails, right? So he just broke it up into 52 emails. And if you sign up for his list, throughout the year you get the entire course anyway. But at the end of each of those emails, he says, go here to buy this thing, and people went and bought it. And all it was was a compilation of this stuff put in a book format so they didn't have to wait. He sold millions and millions of dollars worth of his book in a really easy way. So we gotta look at this and say, wow, that's cool. I can go out there and I could provide value to the market. And again, remember, providing value is this elusive term that all the gurus use, but what is it really? Well, what it is is giving something that's going to help people. If I'm in the crafts business, how can I help them? If you teach them how to build a snowman out of tin cans or whatever, right? They're gonna say, wow, I really like that. I wanna see what else this person has to offer. And they're gonna come to you and they are gonna look at all the things that you have to offer and they are going to want to buy more. And even if they don't buy more right on the spot, they're, you're gonna go out there and these people are going to say, Marcus or whoever it is, Mrs. Crafty Monica is out there and, and she's giving us this value. Let's check out her website. Let's check out what she has to offer. And you could simply compile some of the crafts into a nice little PDF, right? You got all these crafts and you're like, download my 35 craft book that'll keep you busy for the next 10 weeks or whatever it is, right? And you could sell this via PayPal and get instant money. You could sell it via Stripe and get instant money. ClickBank, instant money. Very important to look at. So Facebook groups are really good. Another one is the SEO piggyback method. Piggyback, all right? The SEO piggyback method is all about getting involved in what's going on right now. What you do is you take the search term you want. Now we all know that SEO sometimes takes time. Right, you put something up and it takes a little bit to rank. It's not instant. But if you take a look at the fact and, and, and look at like, okay, there are top 10 results for whatever term I'm looking up, right? If I'm in the crafts business or I'm in the mortgage business, there's 10 results that pop up anyway. Is there a way in those 10 results that I can piggyback? 
Perhaps there's a blog that I can comment on. Maybe there's a forum that I can post a, a content on a forum. Maybe there's a Facebook group that ranks in the top 10 that's getting traffic right now. Maybe there's a guy I can contact for guest blogging and I could put my blog post up and instantly be part of the traffic he's getting right now. This is something you can use. Now, when you do this, what's gonna happen is you're gonna get instant traffic and you're gonna start to build your blog as an authority and it's gonna start to rank and it's gonna start to do better. And you go out there and you make it work. For the craft lady, there's tons of blogs about crafts. There's tons of things on Medium, Quora, Reddit, all these kind of things about crafts or YouTube, right? If you get YouTube, if you do it right and you focus on the right video, one that you can actually get, obviously you're not gonna rank for like how to sew a mask because there's lots of people ranking for it, but you could rank for something more specific and you could do it right now. You could go shoot a video on your iPhone or your whatever phone you have, Android phone, and then you could put it up on YouTube and get instant traffic. And then you can use some of the other things I teach you to compound it. SEO piggyback method is a great way to get in there. I've used this to go buy banner ads on sites that are ranking right now, go directly to a guy and say, hey, you know what, can I purchase space on your, on your site? Um, very easy to use. And, and the cool thing is, is these guys are getting the traffic right now. They did the waiting. They did all the backlinking. They did all the stuff. They just don't know how to make money with it, which 99.9% .9 of people on the internet don't know how to make money off their stuff. That's why they're settling for little paychecks from AdSense and, and Amazon and things like that because they don't know what they're doing. But if you focus and you go direct and you say, hey, look, I can get involved in what's already going on, then boom, you can get out there and make it work in a really, really easy way. Another one is YouTube videos and live streams. YouTube video and live streams. Lately with all the craziness going on, some YouTube channels have been blowing up. They do news, they do content. I even saw one channel where the guy just films like the stock market thing going up and down and that's all he does. It's like live streams of how the market's doing. And the guy gets thousands and thousands of people to watch his stuff in a really easy way. Now, these are things you can do. Obviously, follow the terms and conditions. Obviously, don't plagiarize. Obviously, don't copy people. But you can provide good content by providing news and updates on what's going on. You can provide your specific take. And you don't even have to be on camera. You can do this with screenshots. You can do this with a voiceover. You can do this with all kinds of things and get lots of people into your live streams and videos. And the cool thing about a live stream and a video is if I ask everyone to buy at the end of the video, I instantly get cash in my pocket because they go in to buy stuff, right? You could have a live stream about stock market stuff and then say, hey, at the end of this, I found a really good course about stock market trading, maybe go over here. Or maybe you have a little banner at the bottom of the video. It says, I hope you've been enjoying this. The stock market's going down today, but if you get this book, it'll help you understand how to trade or, or whatever it is. Very, very, very important. And you can do this because this stuff gets traffic instantly and you will instantly get people in. Now, again, you gotta focus on your titles. You gotta focus on the stuff. I teach this in my course over at simplesitesbonus.com. That course will teach you in depth how to use all these the right way and how to really get in there and figure out what people are, are watching, what people are consuming, and how to make it in a way that's gonna get in front of them. Because there is a system, there's a strategy to making this work, and you gotta focus. But making YouTube videos and live streams is a great way to get in front of your audience. Let's say you're a mortgage broker or a financial advisor. Right, right now, financial advisors are like not doing that great because like the advice that is financial, people are losing money and they're not happy about that and they're kind of scared to spend money. So a financial advisor, what if he just came on every day and read the top headlines and talked about what's going on? Hey, oil prices are negative 40 bucks or whatever. What does that mean for you? Very simple, right? You do a little bit of research, you understand the stuff, you get out there, you put the content in front of people, and you say, hey guys, by the way, my website is Bob the Financial Advisor, go check me out, right? Or, or hey, we have this special call, drive them to a special call about how to do financial advising. Guys, this is not hard to do. It's not hard, you just go out there and you teach people good stuff and you help them out. You help them understand what's going out. Whatever your market you're in, if you're in crafts, 
You can do the same thing. Here's five crafts to make in quarantine or whatever it is. Or you could tackle the mask one maybe with a different angle. And you go out there and you focus on things that can actually work and can actually get you in front of the audience you want. Again, if you wanna make instant money, you gotta get instant traffic. There's no two ways about it. You can't just set up a site with an order form and expect people to buy. You gotta drive people to it. You can't just set up a site with affiliate offers and expect people to buy. You gotta be proactive about getting people to your site. You gotta be proactive about getting the right people to your site. Yesterday, we had a guy on the site, on the, on the live training, and he was like, okay, I'm doing this Facebook stuff and I get all this traffic from like Indonesia and, and all this stuff. And I'm like, okay, well, can the people in those areas afford what you have to offer? Well, no, and I'm not getting any conversions. Well, that's why. You gotta focus on the people that you specifically want. If you're a, ad, you're, if you're a financial advisor in the UK, you know, you gotta focus on UK terms. What are people looking up? They're not looking up, you know, like stock market or whatever. They're looking up like Brexit and whatever they're looking up for their stock market. And it's very important to look at because you have to get the right person to the right offer, okay? The chances of putting something up and getting millions of visitors overnight is pretty rare actually like damn near impossible. And even if you do get that, are they the right people? I would rather see you focus on a small group of the right people than try to get everyone and then weed them out. Guys, we can do this by playing in the niches and focusing on what people are looking up. It's very important. Lots of people are doing it. They're making anywhere from $1,000 to hundreds of thousands of dollars a month just doing these things. And all you gotta do is learn the strategy, go down the list, focus and say, how can I give these people value? How can I help them out? So YouTube videos and live stream are great for this stuff. Another thing is live streams on other platforms. I know people that are personal friends of mine that they do live streams on Facebook. They got Facebook groups, they have friends with Facebook groups and they go and they do a live stream on Facebook and they're on there and I'm like, dude, do you ever sleep because you're live streaming every day? And they're like, well, I just live stream every day and you know, I'm making $50,000 a month or $20,000 a month or whatever it is, just live streaming on Facebook. And what's gonna happen is your first live stream might not get that many people. But as you grow and as you build, you're gonna get more and more and more. And you can actually use this method up here of going to Facebook groups, and you can say, hey guys, I know you're in this WordPress group. Uh, here's the top 10 WordPress tips I've learned. By the way, if you like this, go over there and check out my live stream. We're gonna live stream on Tuesday at eight o'clock or whatever, and they're gonna go watch it. Guys, if you get 30, 50, 100, maybe more to watch your live stream, the chances of making a sale are great. Usually on webinars, you could see between a 10 and 40% conversion rate, depending on your audience and depending on your offer. So if you go low and you're like, okay, well, 10% conversion rate, if I got a $97 product or I got a product that's maybe 500 bucks or whatever, okay? Let's say you got a product that's 97 bucks and you get 10%. If you get 50 people on a webinar times 10%, that's five orders at 97 bucks. That's 500 bucks instant money just like that for providing some tips that aren't that hard to provide. And I want you to remember the big secret, these people looking this stuff up, like they buy things and they're interested in this stuff and it converts like crazy and they all want basic info. Like no matter what I do, no matter what happens, when I put a video out about how to get started with affiliate marketing, you guys go crazy. People are like, I've been watching Marcus for five years, but I still need to learn how to get started. And that's it, right? And they're like, oh, there you go. How many of you guys can teach someone how to build a simple WordPress site? Can you? How many of you guys can do that? You're like, yeah, I could teach someone how to build a simple WordPress, add a theme. You know, it's not that hard to do, right? You could go out there and you could make videos on how to start your first website. Guess what? The web hosting company pays anywhere from 65 to $300 when someone signs up for web hosting. What do you need to build a site? You need web hosting. Or if you're in the crafts market, you go out there and you're like, okay, I hope you like my 10 crafts Zoom live webinar or Facebook live stream or whatever it is. Please go over here and check out my book on the 35 crafts. It's on sale today for only $27. Boom, instant cash. Very easy to set up, very easy to make happen. You can literally set this stuff up in minutes and make money for a long 
time. Very cool. All right. So very cool. Uh, live streaming on Facebook is free. Doesn't cost anything. Uh, you would need a tool. You could either use your webcam, your phone, or you could use a streaming tool. I know OBS uh, Studio is free. That's what I use to put on these shows and got little things on the bottom and all kinds of stuff. I mean, really cool software. Uh, it's free to use. So like you could get started with very little cash um, and there's free tools you can use. Uh, if you're doing screen recording, you can do uh, screen flow or you could even use uh, Camrec. That's a free program. Uh, very, very cool. So live streaming on Facebook is good. If you're out there and you're like, dude, I need to make some money. I wanna make this work. Live streaming on Facebook is great. Again, focus on providing value, focus on getting people in. And I have seen people go from nothing to hundreds of thousands of dollars a year using just Facebook live streams, right? Right now, while you're watching this, there are millions, probably hundreds of millions of people on Facebook. Now, 99 million are promoting stupid conspiracy theories, but at any rate, right, you can do that. You can do a video about how to not get sucked into the latest conspiracy theory or whatever. Okay, and you can look at that and you can focus and be like, okay, I could help people with this stuff. Uh, videos on Twitter, absolutely. Twitter's a great way. I think that's uh, number 10 here. Okay, so helpful social media live streams. Another way to get instant traffic is pay per click traffic. You could literally go to Google and you can set up an ad and it'll be running on Google instantly, like within five minutes. And you could go and you can use that to drive traffic to your site drive them to a webinar, drive them to a training, drive them to a free report, whatever it is you have, or you could even drive them to a sales page. Or we're gonna get into some other stuff. You could do like live chat and stuff. Another method of paid traffic could be banners, right? You can go in banners. You find a guy who's number one on the search engine. You're like, I wanna buy a banner on your site. How much is it? You buy the banner, boom, it's up there within like a day or so, and you're ready to rock. I buy banners every single month, thousands of dollars worth of banners, and they pay off big time. Okay, so we gotta look at that. Banners are very good. You can also do solo ads. You can also do sponsored videos. Or video ads, All right? Those are really good and you can get in front of your audience like right now. You literally go on Google and you tell them, I wanna to advertise to everyone who's watching affiliate marketing videos or crafting videos or videos about this or videos about that. You put your ad in, you pay for the amount of people who view like 30 seconds or something, and then boom, you're ready. You get traffic right now. Okay, very important. Next up, we have uh, forum posting. Forums are great. Forums are a place people go for information. There's forums about how to build a home stereo system, how to set up your TV, how to do WordPress, how to craft, how to set up your homestead for survival, right? There's all kinds of forums where people are at and they are looking at them right now. There's forums for people who fish, like where's the best fishing spot in Florida or whatever, right? And they have these forums and you can go to the forums and you can help people out and you can make money. Very, very simple. You can make money through an affiliate offer, through your own offer, through whatever it is you have. Now, here's the deal. When it comes to affiliate marketing or maybe you're a financial advisor or a realtor or whatever it is and you're struggling, other people won't take the time to do this. How many webinars have you seen about choosing the right fishing lure? Zero. How many webinars do you see for from a financial advisor talking about certain things that are popping up. Not that many. There's like five good guys doing it right and the rest are doing it wrong. So you could get out there and you can put your content in front of people and very, very easily see what's going on, right? So forums are a great way to go. Now, if you guys can't read my writing, you can get these notes over at downloadmynotes.com. We always post the latest notes of the latest videos over on downloadmynotes.com. Just put your name and email in the box and you will get the notes as soon as they're ready. All right, so forums are great. I had a guy years ago, he came to me and he's like, Marcus, I just bought your course. How can I make money instantly? And I was like, well, go do some forum posting. He came back an hour later and he's like, dude, I made 60 bucks. I'm like, see, I, I keep trying to tell everyone that what I do works if you actually do it. But the fact of the matter is, is most people will post one thing on the forum, they'll do it wrong and they'll say, this doesn't work. I didn't make $9 million overnight from one five word post. You're not going to, right? You got to get out there and you got to get in the trenches and you got to find people. Like if I was out there and I had to sell home security systems, 
I wouldn't put a little chair outside and say home security systems ask me how. I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna go knock some doors and be like, hey guys, did you realize the crime statistics are this? Would you like to buy a home? I'm gonna go door to door and I'm gonna make it happen. But the problem is, is we lose track of the make it happen because we expect the internet to just like, I turned on my computer, Marcus, where's my money? It didn't fly out of the CD-ROM drive, right? Well, it doesn't. You gotta go and you gotta actively find people. You gotta find out what they're searching for. You gotta find out what they're looking at on forms. And this is not hard to do. That guy went out there an hour later, he had 60 bucks. If he did that all day, every day, he'd be making a living, right? Probably a better than a living. If he did five hours a day, 300 bucks a day, that's like a hundred grand a year posting on forums. Now again, don't spam, don't give junk. The key is to provide value to yourself. Get people to say, I like this, I want this, I'm interested in this, this Marcus guy is helping me out. You gotta look at it, you gotta focus, you gotta make it happen. You need to make it happen. It's time to stop expecting to buy a product and get rich overnight. It doesn't work that way, right? That's not who I cater to. If you want that, there's plenty of push button systems you can waste your money on other places. And when you're done, and you're like, Marcus, I wasted 10 grand trying to figure out how to make instant money without doing anything. And I'm like, well, you could have like saved your money and spent all that time actually doing what works. But it's funny because people will go out there and they'll spend their entire life trying to find an easy way to do something, which is actually harder than just actually doing it. I do this myself, guilty as charged. I will learn about something, I'll read something, I'll spend forever. And I'm like, well, if I would have just done it, I would have gotten results. If you just do these things, you'll start to get results. And better than that, you'll learn. Your first forum post might suck. Your first video on YouTube is probably gonna suck. If you look at mine, I look like a talking stick. It's terrible, right? But over time, you learn and you grow and you do better. And here's the key. In the beginning, even though my videos weren't that good, even though my blog content wasn't that good, I was still making money. Now, compared to today, I wasn't making nearly as much, and it did take a lot more work, but I had to start somewhere. And how many of you guys are like, Marcus, I wanna start somewhere. I wanna make this work. I wanna go do this. I wanna make it happen. And it's very important because it's not hard to do. It's not hard. You need to get past info overload, and you need to focus on what really, really, works. You got to focus on what really, really works because this stuff works. Now you say, Marcus, does internet marketing work? Well, do people go to websites? Yeah. Do people buy stuff? Yeah. Then internet marketing works. Well, Marcus, does affiliate marketing work? Do people go to affiliate websites? Yeah. Do people buy stuff? Yeah. Well, then it works. All you got to do is reverse engineer it and figure out how it works because there are people in crazy little niches, crazy niches about how to put your food in bags, heat it up in a water bowl and then cook it that are making $100,000 a month. Like literally, that is a niche. And you look at it and you're like, Marcus, I thought I had to be in like mortgage or fine. No, you don't. There are people making lots of money in little niches and you can go out there and there's forums about these people putting food in bags and cooking it in water and then cooking it later, right? There's all kinds of stuff and you can get in front of them and you can sell whatever it is you have to offer. You gotta be creative. You gotta think about the market and you gotta give good things, right? The example of people looking for web hosting. I make thousands of dollars each and every month teaching people how to build a website and pointing them to web hosting. I don't sell anything. They go buy web hosting and I get paid. Oftentimes they sign up for a free trial or get a free domain and I still get paid, which is really, really cool. And you could do this with everything. Think about it right now. How many people online are wondering how to use the Zoom program? Lots of people. You could do a training on Zoom. I actually have one loaded up. I got to edit it. It'll be on my channel later today or tomorrow morning. And it's about 10 ways to make money with Zoom. Why do I do that content? because I know the people using Zoom are probably working online in some capacity and it'll get me the people that I want. And then those people will come in, they'll buy some stuff and boom, there we go. 
So forums are very, very good. And you can drive people from forums to a free training. And here's the deal. Everything you do, if you do a live stream on Facebook, it's automatically recorded. If you do a free training on Zoom, you can record it. If you do a live training here on YouTube, it's automatically recorded. And then it goes into your database of videos and people will watch it over and over and over again. It'll get new visitors a year from now or two years from now. If you do this right, it'll compound, it'll build, it'll grow, and you could still get that instant cash right now. My philosophy is all about making money right now. Like I, I'm, I'm the least patient person in the world. I send an email, I'm like, why am I not making money yet? What's going on? And I check all my stuff and I'm like, dude, just freaking wait, right? But I'm impatient. Why? Because I like to see results. I like to see cash coming in. I like to see things happening. And if you want to build your cash flow, no matter what business you're in, if you're a realtor, you can do this. Realtors are sitting on their butt right now. Oh, no one's buying a house. Get out there. Take your camera and go do a Zoom walkthrough of a house. Go out there and do a live training. Hey guys, this is Marcus the Realtor. Today we're going to talk to you about five trends that are happening in my city, in my state, USA. Here's what's happening. We're going to give you the lowdown. Did you know that right now prices are down 15% and they're expected to drop even more? Now's the time to buy a house. Now, if you're selling a house, here's some tech. Guys, it's not that hard to do. Like it's literally there and the internet has provided it. And if you don't know anything about anything or have a business, you can learn about it. There are people that literally read the news and, and talk about it and they, they make a fortune. They're just reading the news and, oh, hey, this is what I think about this. Here's how this works. Here's how this is going to affect you. Very important. If you're a financial advisor, here's 10 things everyone needs to know about the upcoming economy. Here's 10 things you need to know about this. Here's five things you need to know about the stock market. It's very easy. You make the template and you say, here's blank things to know, to know about blank. Here's blank things to know about blank. Put your niche in there. Here's five things to know about making crafts from home. Here's 10 things to know about the state of the real estate industry online or whatever it is. And boom, you go out there and people will be interested. In order to get people interested, you got to have something interesting. Very important. This is what we talk about with copywriting and everything like that. You have to be interesting. You have to get people interested in what you have in a cool way. You don't just say, hey, I'm Bob. I'm doing a live stream about real estate. No, 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 no. You make it juicy. 10 things real estate brokers don't want you to know about the coming crash or whatever it is. Make it true. Make it honest. Make it good. And then lead them to it and talk about it. And it's not that hard. You literally go on a camera if you want to be on screen like me, or you could fire up your software and you could just put notes and read notes. There are people that make a fortune reading their blog posts on video. They make a fortune and all they do is read a book. Hey, step one, do this. Step two, do that. Step three, do that. And it's very, very simple to do. Okay, so we got those. Um, we also got guest post on blog. We'll try to keep them all on this. And again, if you want the notes, go to downloadmynotes.com. So you have guest post on blog okay so you can go on other blogs and do guest posting which is very easy very simple to do you go out there you say hey can i do a guest post i got some content about this i think it'll get you some traffic they'll let you link back to your site or your offer and boom you now piggyback on the traffic they get again make it interesting make it something people are wanting to do and it's very easy and make sure you give this video a thumbs up so more people can see it and be helped very cool all right so guest post on blogging um, number, whatever number we're on, create something that'll get passed around. Create something viral. All right, viral is deliberate. You want things to go viral deliberately. You can make a report, you can make a blog post, you can make something that people will pass around and it can get really big, whether it's a free download, a free video, video whatever it is, you could put it out there and get lots of people to it. Another one, is get affiliates to promote your product. I'll never forget uh, years ago when I first started teaching internet marketing, I had been making money online for 10 years and a buddy of mine was like, why don't you come on this webinar and teach what you do? 
I'm like, okay, I can do that. And I got on his webinar and I'll never forget what it was like. I didn't get the traffic. It was all his traffic. He promoted the webinar. I go on the webinar. I made like $36,000. I split it with him. And I was like, dude, that's pretty cool. I just made 18 grand profit in an hour by just showing up and doing the same training that I do everywhere else anyway. Very, very cool. Uh, you can get affiliates to promote your product and you just split the commission with them. Now, the key is, is you got to have something good and valuable for the market. You can't just go out there and be like, hey, I wrote this book and no one ever buys it. But Marcus, I'll give you 50% if you promote it. It ain't going to work that way. You got to have something good that fits what it is they're offering. Very important. Now, those are our instant traffic source methods. Now we're going to go in and we're going to talk about how to get instant sales. Okay, how do we get instant sales? So we're gonna go out there, we're gonna get this traffic, and now we got the traffic. Because a lot of people have gotten traffic, but they weren't able to get instant sales or conversions, okay? Now the reason is twofold. One, either their offer's not good, maybe your offer just sucks, or two, they're getting the wrong traffic. Now, more likely than not, it's probably number two, because people don't really understand what it means to get the right traffic. If I go out there and I, I do a video on Facebook about economic conspiracy theories and I expect to get a 10% conversion to my financial services, it's not gonna work that way. But if I do go out there and I find people that are looking for financial services and then I put it in front of them, the conversion rate's gonna be a lot higher. So instead of going for everyone, go for just the people you want. Just the people who have the means, the, the need, the desire for what you have to offer. If you're going for the wrong person, this isn't gonna work, okay? And if you've already gotten a bunch of the wrong people, figure out what you can sell them that's the right thing. All right, so now we're gonna assume that you went through step one, page one, and you found the people that you want and you're getting in front of them, and now how do you make money? How do you make money with this, okay? What you wanna do, is you wanna find, if you want instant money, a direct offer. Find a direct offer, okay? Lady out there doing the crafts, she's got all the crafts, she's working on the crafts, she gets people to watch videos, do stuff about crafts. What's the direct offer? Well, you can go and maybe find like, you know, Joanne Fabrics coupon, or maybe a toolbar, or whatever, or you could sell your book of crafts, right? Find something direct. You want something direct. This is direct response marketing. We are not branding. Branding is where you have Coca-Cola, and they're like, hey, taste the real thing, yay, Coke. Hey, we're on the beach throwing baseballs, buy Coke. Hey, we're at the club, and instead of drinking, we're having Coke. That's branding. Okay, that's getting a message in your mind over and over and over and over and over again until you go to the store and you're like, I better get a Coke because I've been hearing about Coca-Cola for the last 50 years and I think I need to drink this sugary beverage, right? And that's branding, okay? What we're doing is direct response marketing. I want you to look at my content and I want you to take action now. I don't wanna wait. That action could be excuse me, filling out an email, buying something, doing a trial, doing an affiliate offer. We want something direct, something I go to the market and I say, this is what I want you to do and I want you to do it right now because it's gonna help you these ways. It's the old adage of here's what I got, here's what it's gonna do for you, here's how to get it. That's the formula. Here's what I got. Hey guys, I got this cool new thing. Like at the end of this webinar, we're gonna talk to you about a special that I'm doing, which I've never done before. And it's gonna give you a one hour call with me. So you get on the line, we do a Zoom call. I go through for an entire hour and I show you, hey, this is how you make money. So if you're info overload, if you're struggling, if you got a website that's not working, if you've been trying things forever and you're like, Marcus, I'm not ready to buy a course. I just want someone to direct me. I want someone like you who's been doing this 20 years to teach me exactly what I need to do. So that would be the offer, right? We're like, here's what I got. I got this one hour call and here's what it's gonna do for you. It's gonna help you make money. Like I guarantee at the end of the, the one hour call, you're gonna say, holy shit, I just learned how to make money online. And if I go do what Marcus said, I will get results, okay? Then you say, here's how to get it. 
and you say, here's how to get it. And at the end of this call, I'll give you the link for it. And when you see the price, you're gonna wanna sign up on the spot, doing this as a test. So when we run out, the price will go up because I can only do so many calls in a day, right? So we're gonna teach you guys how to do that. And if you're interested in that, type in uh, one hour call. Very cool, okay? So we need a direct offer. Again, here's what I got. Here's what it's gonna do for you. Here's where to get it. Follow that formula, it does not fail. Follow it, do it right, make sure you get the right people. Right? If I get people who are two feet tall or five feet tall, maybe they're like me, they're five foot one, and I'm selling a jacket for oversized men, I don't care how good it is, they're not gonna buy it because it's, it's not gonna fit, right? So you gotta have the right person. So here's what I got, here's what it's gonna do for you, here's where to get it. Now, how to get instant sales? You wanna find a direct offer. You can do this with PayPal and you could get money instantly. Like literally, like there you go. My, my record years ago when I was using PayPal, now we use um, a merchant account, uh, was making, I think it was 1300 bucks in like six minutes or something. Crazy, right? It was like, I went on a forum and I posted some stuff and a couple minutes later I had 1300 bucks in my account, which was really cool. And I was like, holy crap, are you kidding me? That's, that's all I gotta do? I could do this all day, every day. And I do that all day, every day, right? And it was really cool because you get money. So you can go out there and you could put an offer. You could do PayPal, ClickBank. You could do affiliate offers. You could do web hosting offers. You could do anything that fits your market. Or maybe you do a training and you're like, hey guys, I got this free training. At the end of the training, you can sell more training. You're like, here you go, there you go, really cool. Okay, so find a direct offer. Looks like a lot of people want that one hour call. We'll get you guys info on that in a little bit. Uh, so you wanna find the direct offer, okay? So what you need to make this work is a hard hitting sales page, okay? A lot of people fail when it comes time to sell the offer. They, they give good content and then they're like, thanks for reading my content, check out this. Okay, that's not really gonna work. What we need to do is we need a hard hitting sales page. So you wanna directly make your content with the purpose of getting people into what you want next. Before I started this webinar, I said, I want people to sign up for my one hour call. That's what I want them to do. I want them to, to understand that this is a life changing call if you really use it. And so I was like, I'm gonna do that. And so I make the content with the idea of getting you to do the next step. If you're doing crafts, you teach them the crafts with the idea of getting them to do the next. Maybe you teach them how to make like a little owl. And you're like, here's the basic owl. If you wanna learn how to make the advanced owl, seven bucks or whatever. Very, very simple. Uh, there's lots of PayPal alternatives, like you can use Stripe, you can use anything. ClickFunnels, ClickBank, whatever. All kinds of stuff, right? It's not hard to do. So you want a hard hitting sales page and you want something direct that's gonna get people where you want them to go. Again, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe and click the bell. Um, so you want a hard hitting sales page. Don't waffle it, don't sell from your heels. If you have something you know is gonna help them, then sell it. If you know it's gonna help them, if it's just junk and you, you don't believe in it, then don't. Now, some of these things are very simple. Like when I was selling toolbars or giving away toolbars for uh, MySpace people. Okay, I was like, hey, I know this will help people. It's simple, it's a download. I don't have to get them to buy anything. I get $3, pretty simple. I made sure that it was a good toolbar with no spyware or anything. Always gotta make sure that. But I did a hard hitting sales page. I didn't just say, hey, you know, MySpace is cool. I think this toolbar will help you. No, I went in, I dug the stuff out and I was like, here's how this toolbar is gonna make your MySpace page kick ass. And then boom, I went in there and did that. So you gotta have a hard hitting sales page. Next. You can do email list building and marketing, okay? You could go out there and you can use all the stuff we talked about on page one to drive people to your site and you can give them a freebie. Say, hey guys, sign up for my free how to do crafts course. Sign up for my free financial education course. Sign up for my free real estate in Winter Springs, Florida course. Sign up for my free whatever, right? Or if you're a restaurant, you're a restaurant and you're like, no one's eating at my restaurant. We have delivery, but no one knows about it. What do you do? You go on Facebook groups in local areas and you post a recipe every day. You say, uh, let's say you own a Olive Garden and you're like, hey, uh, do you miss the lasagna at Olive Garden? Here's how to make it. Pretty simple. People are gonna be like, dude, that's pretty badass. Now I can make some stuff. And it's never gonna turn out like the restaurant. It never does, right? 
If you're me, it usually turns out better, but you know, to each his own, right? And we're gonna go out there and you teach them a recipe a day. And on every recipe, you get them to eat, opt in for the recipe. You put them on a list for when you open back up. And in the meantime, you say, by the way, we deliver. And if you order from this email, we're gonna deliver your, your food and there's no delivery cost. Boom, instant business. People are waiting to buy stuff from you. People are waiting to get this stuff. Be proactive. Restaurants are dying on the vine right now because they're not taking advantage of this. This is something I year, lear, uh, learned years ago. Let me see if I can find the book. Years ago, when I was a beginner affiliate marketer, there's a book I have here somewhere. There it is. I bought this book, okay? I had very little money in the bank and I didn't know what to do. And so I bought this book on guerrilla teleselling. I was like, well, you know, I mean, I need to make money. I got a kid, we need to eat. And uh, I have no money. So I can learn telesales. I can call people up and I can get them to buy stuff. And guess what I did? I called people up. Now, you might say, I don't wanna call people, Mark, because I don't wanna actually work. And that's fine. Um, get in line for government checks if that's what you wanna do. That's cool, right, to each his own. But if you want to be aggressive about this stuff, again, you don't have to call. I don't do very many calls these days. We go out there and I look for this. So what I learned in this book was tips on going out there and getting business now. Guerrilla Teleselling, they have lots of other books about guerrilla marketing. And it's about going after people you want directly. You can't sit around and wait for people to come to you. How many of you guys have been doing it and you're like, no one's come to me yet? They're not going to. Got to be aggressive. You got to find them in the Facebook groups. You got to find what they're watching on YouTube. You got to look at what they search for their search engines. You got to look at the forums and see what they're talking about. And guess what? I used to have to pick up the phone and call limousine companies. I'd be like, hey, this is Marcus. I, I can help your limousine company get more business. I made sales. It's making anywhere from 200 to a couple thousand dollars a day doing that. Pretty cool, right? Now, 20 years after I did that, online, it's all done for you. Like, if you're not doing this, you're just lazy. There's no two ways about it. If you're not out there doing it, you're just being lazy. And you're blaming it on whatever. And I get it. There's some bad teachers teaching some bad stuff, which is why you like to subscribe and click the bell and give my videos a thumbs up because we teach you the real world stuff. We don't fool around. We teach you, hey, this is things you got to do the work. Like, this is something you can do in 15, 30 minutes, maybe an hour a day. And it's something you can use to change your life if you do it right. But most people won't do it. They're not willing to put in the effort. They're not willing to go out there and find customers. They want to just set something up and, you know, oh, hey, you know what? I, I got a blog and I'm not rich. Why am I not rich? Because you're not going after the right people. You're not going after the right people and you don't have the right offer. You got to go out there and you got to be proactive and you got to do it. And right now, a lot of people have a lot of time on their hands. This is something you can be doing. Instead of watching whatever that tiger guy's doing on Netflix, you could go out there and you can learn to make money. But so many people look at it proactively, proactively, and they look at it and they focus and they, they gotta get in there and make it happen. You gotta go out there. You gotta do this, right? Very important. So email and list building and marketing. Email list building is a way you can get instant money. You send an email, you show them an offer, you send them some good content, you make an offer. Very simple. Another one, direct, direct contact with visitors. Make direct content with, try, content, I can't talk today. Make direct contact with your visitors. People come to your website, have a little live chat button. Say, hey, how can I help you? What do you need help with today? I notice you're looking at this. Or let them email you. Let them email you. All right, we're gonna get rid of freelancer Bob, dude, because he's bugging me. Okay. Um, get an email list. Make a box. I built a business from $238 its first month to a, I think our best month with that one was $109,000, right? $109,000 in one month. How did I do it? I made a page and I said, get this free thing. They put their name and email in. 
I sent them to another page. This is back before we had all these fancy WordPress plugins. And then I said, on the second page, said, get your free thing. Thank you for getting your free thing. It's gonna be in your email. Now, tell me your number one question about X. Get your free course on how to uh, weather the storm financially. Good. What's your number one question about how to make it through this crisis financially intact? They email you. Guess what? You email them back. Did you know that by emailing people back directly, your conversion rate goes through the roof? Why? Because no one does it. Let me, let me ask you, how many of you guys on this call right now have ever been emailed back by an affiliate marketing guru? We'll use the guru in quotes. How many of you guys have been emailed back? Anyone personally, not a, not just a blast email, but like actually personally. And if it's because I emailed you back, that doesn't count. We're talking about the other guys, right? I've emailed you back before, right? How many of you guys have done that? Type zero if, if you've never gotten a personal email from the affiliate marketing guru who claims that he wants to help you, okay? Looks like we got a bunch of tumbleweeds and chirps in the chat box, which means that no one has, which means if you do, even if you're not the biggest guru on the planet, you're gonna get conversions. I guarantee you these people aren't doing it. They're not doing it. Financial advisors, how many of you guys have gotten a, an email directly from them? And guess what? This will go up like crazy. I actually tested this on my website about how to beat alcoholism. I'm six years sober, so I have a site about teaching people what I did to get sober. And so I put a little form and I said, fill this out, tell us about your drinking. And then I put a little box that said, tell us your question. You can actually go in and respond to the emails. Now, again, be careful if you're in like an addiction market, make sure you know what you're talking about and you disclaimer the hell out of it. But you go in there and you're like, hey, Bob, I noticed your number one question about this was this, right? And we go out there and we're like, hey, I email them back and you're gonna get sales. It takes you five minutes to write an email and you could make a hundred bucks, a thousand bucks. One email I wrote back generated a $20,000 sale from one email. It took me like five minutes to do. Now that doesn't happen every day, but the majority of the emails I do work. Now, a lot of people are like, they just wanna sit behind a site and expect sales to roll in. If you do this, you're gonna make so much more than the competition, it's not even funny. Like it's insane. And what are you doing? You just type in. That's it. You just type in. You type all day anyway. So instead of sharing your stuff on Facebook, why don't you make money with it? Right? It doesn't matter. Like everyone's typing anyway. It's just knowing what to type and to who. That's the difference between sales. Knowing what to type and knowing who to send it to. Very important. Now, we're not talking about spam. Very important. We're talking about only contacting people who have filled in the form. And they will. How many of you guys would love the chance to just ask me whatever question about your website? How many of you guys would be like, yeah, dude, I'd, <laughs> hell yeah, I'd, I'd like you to give me, I'd like to email you and get some advice on my website. That would be great. I'd like that. Think about that. There's other people out there that would do that on your websites too. So direct content with contact with visitors, live chat, great way. Every time I turn on live chat, I make money. So simple, okay? Next, Q and A pages, question and answer pages. People got questions. You can make top 10 questions about this product. Uh, in the video I did a couple weeks ago, we were talking about this uh, video thing. It's a video switcher. And I talked about how there's lots of questions people have about it. It's a thousand dollar piece of equipment. I spent multiple thousands with stuff to make it work. And people are spending money on this. Right, they're out there. Like how many churches right now do you think are looking for equipment to live stream their services? Probably like, I don't know, most of them because you can't go to church right now because of the, the issue. This little thousand dollar thing will take care of that. You could switch cameras, you could do all kinds of cool stuff. And when I sell that, if I get a 3% commission, that's 30 bucks. If I get a 10% commission, that's a hundred bucks. I could probably even get more if I do the search and look for it. And all I got to do is make a little Q&A page. Here's the top questions and answers about this product. Super easy as hell to rank for that. Put a live chat on it and they'll be like, hey, you know, we got 10 questions, but I wanted to know, does this work with the Canon 5650? You go to Google, you type in Canon 5650, you type in Roland VH1 and see if it works. 
And you're like, yes, I found out there was someone who did that and it did work. Click here to buy it. 10 seconds, 100 bucks commission. How many of you guys would do that? Would anyone not do that? You're like, no, Marcus, I will not spend 10 seconds for a $100 commission because my name is Jeff Bezos and I make more than that every 50 seconds and get all the tax breaks in the world, right? I think everyone should do this if you don't have tons of money already, right? So very easy to do. Um, another one you could do is live webinars. Live webinars. Here's a live webinar this week teaching you how to live stream your church service. You teach them how to do it. You're like, you open up the, the OBS studio, you do this. By the way, if you want to use multiple cameras, uh, go get this product over here. This is the best deal. After you buy it, I'll teach you how to use it. Not that hard, right? What are you doing? What is all this about? Filling the gap. Filling the gap. People have questions. People need answers. People want to know stuff. It's so simple to do. It's not even funny. You could go make a video on that product. You could say, hey, we're going to have a free training on how to use it. Buy through this link. We'll have the free training. We'll teach you how to use it. You want to get this? We'll teach you how to do this. Very simple. You could do live webinars about your topics. Live webinars. Okay. You can do a news style update videos. Okay, a lot of people, new style update. Here's an update on the market. You could do them for your specific town. You're a realtor, you're a financial advisor, you're affiliate marketer. Here's an update on the affiliate marketing industry. What do you think that one was I did the other day? Amazon lowers affiliate commissions. Who's gonna watch it? A bunch of affiliates. What's the customers I want? A bunch of affiliates. I make a video, took me about, that one was a pain. I kept screwing up, so it took me about three hours total. Um, took me three hours, lots of visitors. Lots of visitors, and now every day on my channel, we're getting about 2,000 people watching it a day. Out of those 2,000, you think people are gonna order? Hell yeah, they're gonna order. Yeah, they're gonna order. You make one about whatever topic you wanna do, and you go out there and you get them and you make it work, and it's not that hard. You fill the gap and you answer the questions. You answer the questions. And you answer them direct, you answer them on live chat, you'll make even more. And guys, this is not hard to do. You just need to go make it work. And if you guys see this and you're like, Marcus, this is cool. This is teaching me exactly how this works. Uh, let's talk about that one hour call. If you wanna sit down with me on a Zoom training, just you and me, no one else, me and you. We get on a Zoom training. You ask me whatever you want. You show me your sites, you show me your stats. If you're new and you don't have a site, you say, Marcus, this is, this is my story. This is what I've been struggling with. I will get you on track. At the end of that one hour call, you will not have info overload anymore if you follow. If you follow what I tell you, we're gonna give you a full plan. You're gonna go on, you're gonna say, this is what I wanna do, this is my niche, or if you don't have a niche, I'll help you find a niche. And we go in there and I'll show you and I'll say, this is your plan. Here's how you get traffic, here's how you do this. If you have a site that's not working, I'll say, this is what you need to do. Whatever it is, we're gonna get you past info overload. Now, this isn't a course, this isn't a training, this is a one hour call directly with what you need. So you don't have to weed through a big course. You don't have to struggle through information you don't need. You go in there, you get on the call with me, and I say, this is what you need to do for your site. Here's where you're doing wrong. Here's where you're doing right. Here's what you need to focus on. At the end of the call, you're gonna thank me and you're gonna say, Marcus, this should have been a $10,000 call. Thank you for not making it $10,000, but it was worth it and you're gonna know exactly what to do. So how many of you guys wanna know exactly what to do? You're like, Marcus, I'm struggling. I need to know how to put all this stuff together for my niche. And I'll go in and I'll show you traffic strategy. And when we're on the call, I'll run keyword reports with my overly expensive keyword software I pay for. I'll get you guys some info. I'll get you all things. And everything I use on the call, the keyword reports, the tools, the stuff we do, sometimes we log into your site and sometimes we fix things on your site. Whatever I do, you get to keep. And guys, this is where it's at. If you want a way to get past info overload and you're tired of everything, or if you're a realtor and you wanna know how to ramp up your business, or a restaurant, you wanna know how to ramp up your business, a network marketer, you wanna know how to ramp up your business, or anything, whatever you're doing, this one hour call will be a game changer, I guarantee it. If you want that one hour call, it's gonna pop up on the screen down there somewhere. It is at joinmarcus.com. Let's see when it pops up on the screen, I can't see here. 
all right, there's the subscribe and click the bell. Make sure you do that too. Uh, but joinmarcus.com, you go there and you make it happen. You make it happen and you focus. And you're like, here we go, right? We're gonna go, we're gonna get that one hour call and follow what I teach you to do. The one hour call will be recorded with screen sharing and everything. Okay, so you'll get a copy of it. It'd be like your own little video to watch over and over so you can follow the plan. You can get that over at joinmarcus.com. The link is below right there in yellow, right? Joinmarcus.com. Uh, right now we have it at a ridiculous price. Usually I charge $4.97 for the hour call. We have it discounted right now because I know people are in a jam and they need some tips to get going right now. So uh, once the calls are sold out, at that price, we will raise the price, so make sure you get in now. And then after you sign up, just go to our support site and request the call. Tina will help you get the schedule. Uh, she's our support ticket person. She'll help you with that. And we'll get you rocking and rolling. And I guarantee after that call, you're gonna know what to do. And if you know what to do, you just go do it and you make it happen. Iris says, money like speed. I need to get past the analysis, paralysis, and procrastination. Iris, get yourself a call at joinmarcus.com. I guarantee at the end, if you still have info overload, it's because you, you were like closing your eyes and ears on the call. You will not have info overload after this call. You will know exactly what you need to do and you'll go do it. And then when you do it and you make some money, come back and buy other stuff, right? Really cool. All right, any questions on that call? And again, that the price is gonna go up because obviously uh, I only have so many one hours in a day. So uh, we need to slow it down after everyone gets the deal. Okay, Ravi says, your trick didn't work. What trick? We don't teach tricks. We teach results-based marketing. Um, so really cool, right? Awesome stuff. But if you wanna humor me, tell me the trick that uh, you said you tried. All right, so again, that's joinmarcus.com. Uh, the cost of the call, I'm not gonna reveal on the webinar because it is gonna change after we get X amount of orders. I think we're going to take 30 at this price, which it'll probably be gone on this webinar. Um, so go to joinmarcus.com to find that out. It's a one-time payment and that's it. You get the call, you get everything. We're going to give you some cool stuff as well. Uh, Thomas, ask that on the support site. They'll, they'll answer that. It depends on when you got your niche, um, but we'll get you guys started. And that's the deal. You're going to get a one hour call with me and you're going to go on there and you're going to ask whatever the heck you want to ask and we are gonna get you rocking and rolling and we're gonna help you out. And guys, that is the key. Like no more floundering around, no more messing around. You guys know I've been doing this 20 years. You know I got the chops, you know this stuff works and you make it happen, right? You make it happen. Uh, freelancer dude, Bab, I'll just pray I'll get you to answer me one day. Uh, freelancer, I think somehow you hacked your way onto a free or, or paid call yesterday. So complaining about not getting answers after getting on a call, like, what do you want me to do? Fly to your house and give you money? I mean, you know, what else do you want from me? Uh, but at any rate, to each his own, right? You got to get in there and you got to do what you want to do. But we're going to kick him out because I had to kick him out of my call yesterday because one, he wasn't supposed to be on there. And two, he just keeps complaining about everything. He's complaining about products he hasn't even bought, which is like, okay, yeah. And by the way, the majority of complaints we get are people who have never ordered. Uh, if you read like reviews and stuff, they never even ordered anything. Um, so to each his own though, I'm not gonna judge. You do what you wanna do. Uh, but if you wanna get that one hour call and you wanna get on the line with me, again, it's with me directly. Uh, you're gonna get in there and we are going to change the fate of your internet marketing business. Use the stuff I've taught you here. Guys, this is good stuff. Use this, what I taught you here today, with your one hour call and you're gonna be unstoppable because we're gonna give you stuff to do and it'll be based on you. You'll come to me, you'll be like, I don't like making phone calls and I don't like making videos. And I'll say, okay, here's your plan. Or you'll say, hey, I, I don't mind making videos. I'm cool with that. I'll give you a plan for that. So up, up front in the beginning of the call, you're gonna tell me, so you're gonna be ready. You're gonna tell me what you like, what you wanna do, uh, everything like that. And we are gonna help you with it. Really, really cool. Thomas says you have great products and services, Marcus. Uh, thank you. Yeah, I work really hard on them. We actually do create them myself. Um, so, you know, other places, they just outsource the content to people who don't know what they're talking about. But we actually do the, the content ourselves. So hop over to joinmarcus.com. Get yourself the one hour call. If you want notes from this video, go to downloadmynotes.com. Uh, you'll get notes from this video. Guys, get that call. 
trust me, when the price goes up, you're going to be kicking yourself saying, man, I should have joined uh, because that's dirt cheap. There's nowhere else I can get something like that where someone's actually going to get on the line with me and help me specifically. And if you have a website, you have a business, whatever it is, we're going to help you with it. I've been doing uh, internet marketing, affiliate marketing. I've helped businesses for 20 years. That's most of my life, actually. Yeah, most of my life because I've been doing it like 20 years and three months and I turned 40 a couple months ago, right? Um, so really, really cool. Just get in there, make it happen. We're gonna help you. At the end of the call, you're gonna know exactly what to do. And when you know what to do, you're pretty much unstoppable. Thanks again for joining this. Give us a thumbs up. Go over to joinmarcus.com. Get your private call with me. Let's make some money. And subscribe and hit the bell. And give this video a thumbs up. While I try to figure out where the button is.